looking for passage to Solstein, you won't find a finer vessel than the Northern Maiden. Surprised you've never heard of it. It's an island northeast of here. That's a small dark elf town called Ravenrock, and a handful of Nords living in Skull Village. People don't usually sail over there unless they have a particular reason. It could be a pretty rough place. I'll give you a fair price. Not many people headed over there these days. If you ask me, I can't blame them. Things aren't what they used to be out there. They still pay me for supplies and passage, and I can always use the coin. Still interested in heading over there? Um, <clears throat> you've got yourself a ship, but we'll cast off immediately. Be careful here. Things aren't what they used to be. I don't recognize you. So I'll assume this is your first visit to Ravenrock. Outlander, state your intentions. You've picked one of the worst places in Morrowind to do that, but suit yourself. Just remember, Ravenrock is sovereign territory of House Redoran. This is Morrowind, not Skyrim. While you're here, you will be expected to abide by our laws. Any questions? I have to be. A second counselor? The security of Raven Rock is my primary concern. This isn't exactly the city of Blacklight. We're on the frontier out here. We've had more than a fair share of trouble. After all we've been through together, I refuse to let Councillor Morvane down. Councillor Morvane is House Redoran's representative on Solstein. A second counselor is my job to support him and make certain his rule is enforced. Ravenrock started out as an imperial settlement. The Empire decided to abandon it, just as my people were first setting foot here. They left the town in shambles. The House Federan took over. We turned it around and it became ours. And even if it's been a struggle to make this island livable, we're proud to call it home. Your ignorance of our homeland doesn't surprise me. It's the capital of Morrowind. It's been that way ever since Mournhold was sacked by the Argonians. I don't visit there often anymore, but we still get the occasional supply ship and visitors from there. Quite a while ago, yes, they cut a bloody swath across most of the southern region of Morrowind. Nobody seems certain why it happened. Attempted expansion, revenge for the enslavement of their people, or perhaps both. Whatever the case may be, thousands of Dunmen needlessly lost their lives. Many more were exiled from their own. Hail, Jolland. Well met, Admiral. Hail, Jolland. Well met, Admiral. Your visit here will be tolerated as long as you abide by our laws. Otherwise, you'll answer to the Redoran Guard. Remember, we are watching you. Before you even ask, yes, at 
the supplies you requested. But... But what? Slow cost me double what we agreed on. Nothing I can do about it. Damn it, challenge! No, we don't have that. The East Empire Company didn't give me a choice. They've raised their prices again. And there's nothing I can do about it. After all these years, they're gouging us for every last break we have. Let me talk to Laryl. I'll see what. All right, then. Don't worry about rushing. Just pay me when you can. Captain Gallon, the 